I wrote him here na claiming 50,000 and uh, yeah, 50,000 50, claiming and he won here. Very impressive that day. And uh, he got claimed. Cipriano got him and took him to Oakland. And he, he actually is doing pretty good at Oakland too. And he runs any kind of track. He won here, he won the dirt. <clears throat> he just ran fourth in the stake for Timberlake. And uh, I think the horse is doing pretty good and hope we can get it right. Uh, he belongs in this kind of race. He, he won pretty good. He just <clears throat> he just ran a great stake race and he ran four. So I think he can compete pretty good with those guys. That would mean a lot to me because uh, I've been doing good at Turfway. I did when I first came to. I did good too, but that's why Jack Je Ruby would be important for me and for my career. Uh, it would be a, the start of a next step, I think, in my career. That would mean a lot. So tell me a little bit about yourself. 2015, the end of 2015, I came to Miami uh, with no, no knowledge, no. I mean, I didn't know nobody. I just came to 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 know to get to know the place and how we work and races and everything. And I ended up riding a, couple, a few horses. And uh, but I went back to Brazil. That was just a visit. Uh, so then, uh, 2018, I got uh, Wesley invited me to come and ride the winter time for him here. And I came. And that was uh, where I started here. Actually, end of 2018. And so you, um, you'll ride the rest of the year. I mean, you're like year-round Kentucky at this point. Yes, yes. Uh, so yeah, I started here, uh, I, I, 2019. So then I have a couple accidents, 19, 2021. It uh, was hard to get business back. Uh, I went to Ohio. I rode around a couple of years in Ohio, chipping everywhere, everywhere else. <clears throat> so then uh, I decided to go back to Kentucky, come back to Kentucky, and I ran third in the same meeting, but like two years ago. And uh, everything was starting getting better, and so then it came next. Next, he started uh, helping my career a lot. About Tennessee, you ride him in the Russia way. Yes, Tennessee, it's, uh, it's actually where we started. It was my first win for him. And... Uh, is it, I mean, he's improving. Every race he's doing better and better, so I hope he can he show even better next race. And let's see, there's another horse that you ride, I'm thinking for Brad, on... Um... Botanical. Yes, yeah. that's like the favorite. In... Yeah, yeah. She, she didn't get beat yet here, so I think she's gonna be tough to get beat. She's pretty good, she's pretty special, really. Yeah, I mean, running for Brad Cox. Um, these horses ran out 30 something million last year. That's yeah. got to be. It's a very, very good connection, and I'm very thankful for his support here at Turfway. He got me a few winners, so it's pretty good. I hope it can get going with this. I will try my best, I promise. <laughs> has, it, has it been what you thought it would be when you first came from Brazil? And, and tell me about your riding career in Brazil. Mm -hmm. Were you like a leading rider down there? No, I was like never a leading rider in Brazil. I won a uh, grade one race, but I, I was never leading rider. I was like fifth, top five. I would say, and, but I always knew I, I would do better, it just wasn't my place, that's why I moved on. I, I, I always thought I could do better than I was doing, that's why I, I, I left Brazil. When you came, did you, oh no, you started in Miami, but yeah. making it to Kentucky, you came at a great time, right, yeah. as the money was really starting to get good, but yeah. before it was getting, right now, who was it, who's it, Tease is coming, Kentucky, his home, and stuff like that, so just your thoughts about the Kentucky circuit, and having, a, you know, kind of choosing this for your base, and then the money's just really, you know, each year it's better and better. Well, when I first got, uh, well, not first got here, but when they really came to stay, 2018, I, I mean, I got here at Turfway, and I, 
I really like the area and the races in Kentucky are going crazy like you say and uh, yeah it is tough but I mean I just believe I can be with these guys and compete with them so I'll be tough too.